Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Wow, we're filming in this area again. Can we just take a moment? Can we just take a moment? Our house is looking good. I'm so happy. We really worked hard during the winter time to like get our house looking good and it was a good time to just like make our house pretty and that's why I'm filming a fun video, kind of like vlog style today because I want it to be like more candid and more, I don't know, on the go. But today I'm going to share how you can reach your fitness goals in 2022 realistically. This is just coming from a girl who just does workouts and has started her journey um, in 2020. So I'll put some photos on the screen so you guys can see like where I came from um, and then like my results now. I can honestly say I have never felt better in my body and like confidence wise and I just feel so much more healthy. When I'm going clothes shopping, I'm a lot more happy because things just look a little better. So um, I hope you guys uh, enjoy this video. If you guys are new here, make sure you're subscribed and also follow me on Instagram because it would mean the absolute world to me. And I guess without further ado, let's just get on into this video. Little disclaimer, I am not a professional. I'm not like certified in personal training. If you guys have like actual questions, like please seek a professional's help, like a doctor or a personal trainer or something of that nature. I just wanted to like put that in this video just in case, but these are just like my fun tips and tricks on like just setting goals and achieving them. So, so my first tip is realization. You kind of have to have that little, uh, not hit rock bottom, but that realization that you want to make a change. And I honestly had that realization. It was in South Carolina. Uh, my cousin was getting proposed to. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it down below. That video, I wore this like black dress. It was a cute black dress. I still have it. And um, in the photos, which I'll put the photo on the screen, I just felt like just not that good about myself. Like I looked at myself and I was just like, I know that's not me, you know? So I want to make a change. And I just like, that was kind of like the moment I saw myself and was like, I want to make a change. I'm going to make a change. Um, I've always been pretty good at like setting goals and just being like, hey, I'm gonna I'm gonna change that. So I do. Um, and I pretty much don't let anything stop me because I kind of learned that in dance to just like work really hard and you will achieve maybe not like your goal like right overnight, but it will take time, just like becoming physically active and becoming more fit in your life. So when I say start and realize, it could be anything. So it could be like walking, it could be doing some weight lifting in the mornings. Like you don't have to run a 5K, you know what I mean? Start with like arm circles. You're not gonna be used to it and you are gonna be sore. So no matter what you do, just start something. Um, and that could be just like walking on a treadmill. That could just be walking in your neighborhood, you know? I mean, fitness does not have to be expensive and it doesn't have to be this thing where like you're paying hundreds of dollars to do something. Buy a bike or you can just run outside. Um, you can do, there's tons of free videos on YouTube. That's what I started. So I just started at home doing free stuff and it actually makes an impact. So that's my first tip, just start doing something. Actually currently in the, in the kitchen, my mom's doing some exercises. So it's fun to like, you know, try to be motivating to someone in your life. I want Sherry to say hi to you. Sherry, say hi to the vlog. Hi, good morning. Valerie's still in her jammy, so you won't see her. My next tip is find what food your body responds to well. Some people have a sensitivity to like gluten or just like anything like that. And you might be a little bit more bloated or something because of a certain food and the bacteria in your digestive system, which I would like recommend you see a doctor about because I clearly don't know everything about that. But I know that bodies, all bodies are different. All bodies will look different. All bodies will digest things differently. So make sure you are ingesting 
like the right things for your body like too much sugar is obviously not good and in america they put a lot of sugar and a lot of different stuff so just making sure and like watching that is really good my body doesn't really respond to carbs that well like i've seen more action and the results i want when i do low carb also portions portions for me are so difficult like i could pack on and consume an entire bag of salt and vinegar chips and it is so good like I do that probably for my birthday and Christmas. They're just so good. But like, honestly, having that as a pattern, like in your regular life is not the best. And like my mom always says, like manatees only eat lettuce, only they eat like an exorbitant amount of lettuce, I think. And they're pretty big. So portions are really important when you're like thinking about, you know, making changes in your life and wanting to see results. And remember that diet is a very big portion of seeing results. Like you can work out all you want, but if you're not burning more calories than what you're consuming, you're kind of like defeating the purpose. It's still good that you're exercising, but like honestly, you have to think about it kind of like in a mathematic, logical point of view. You need to be burning more than you're consuming when it boils down to it to see results. So just really make sure that you are watching what you eat and that your diet is well proportioned because that's just a really big part of it, unfortunately, because ugh, I could consume so much like junk. Cheez-Its are amazing, amazing, okay. Wow, it has been a long time. Well, not that long, but it's been a while since I've had this as a background and no boxes in it. Can we just like take a moment? So the next tip I have for you is to not get bored. Um, on my fitness journey, I actually wrote this down because um, I've done like so much stuff to change it up in my routine. So I've tried running. Um, I'm now cycling a lot. Um, I've done at home workouts and I've tried a few people like Chloe Ting. Pamela Reef is my favorite. I've tried Mad Fit, but I just found her videos not for me. I personally don't really like them. Um, and now we're going to try some yoga because I got this really, really fun product. So thank you to I'm Unlimited for sponsoring today's video. I really like the product. It's really easy. I was nervous when they reached out because I've never really done Pilates. Um, I actually recently did a video without, um, a tool to use and it was pretty fun. So like definitely on my chill days, like busting out and doing some Pilates is always fun. So today I'm going to show you guys and talk about the I'm Unlimited Pilates bar. So basically the I'm Unlimited Pilates bar is a portable Pilates studio. Like you can take this anywhere and you could probably even take it in like your suitcase because this comes apart so you can undo the bar and you can probably like pack it. It's very compact and obviously you can un clip these it's so simple it just pops right into place and bam you have a pilates bar so basically this comes with tons of different resistance bands i was actually going to use the 10 pound bands but i decided to use the blue ones because it matches my outfit i know that's like kind of off topic but anyway look at how many options comes with this pilates bar I can't get over it. You have a lot of options to choose from. And for the beginners, they also send you this um, guide so you can learn some of the poses and you can learn how to set up the Pilates bar. They give you some poses and exercises to do. This actually really helps me out when setting it up. Um, so you can see here too, they have um, just all of this information on setting it up. I'm just so excited because I think it's really easy to use and you can use it from your house and has a lot of options to choose from. So I am going to try this on out. So the I'm Unlimited Pilates bar that I received includes 12 resistance bands ranging from 15 pounds to 50 pounds. And this specific bar is the only one in the market that comes with that amount of bands, which is amazing because when you're working out, you obviously build strength. So you definitely want to be challenging yourself. I always love a good challenge at the end of the day. 
The bar also has two loops at each end. One is stationary and the other, the gray loop, is adjustable. I'm Unlimited invented the second loop, which is gray, to efficiently impact some specific muscles, especially the arms and legs. So if you guys are interested in purchasing the I'm Unlimited Pilates bar, you can use the code 15Pilates for 15% 15 off your order. It's cool, check it out. If it's not meant for you, it's not meant for you, but just see what it's all about online. And thank you again to I'm Unlimited for sponsoring today's video. Wow, I've never filmed here before. I'm trying to change it up, guys. My last and final tip is not important to some, like. It's not that important to me, but it certainly does help, is finding community. Community is important, whatever you're doing. And my headband is slowly sliding up my head. I'm just gonna take this off. Um, but community is important because you can make new friends and everything like that. That's why I love Cycle Bar. Um, I found a good friend there and we go together and it's so fun. Also, my other friend who lives kind of far away also does cycle bar. So you have like something to talk about and everything. So finding that community and finding belonging in something is just amazing. Again, even there's Pilates classes. So you could do Pilates with someone, uh, which I might try doing. Like there's Orange Theory. There's so many places that you can go to connect with people. Um, also, you know, like staying safe and stuff like during the pandemic, but still having that community and finding um, your people and people that have common interests like you, you know, you already have something in common because you're doing something physically good to your body and you're treating yourself right and you're taking a step to better yourself. So anyway, I think that is going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, make sure to check out the first link in the description box. That'll have all of the information about the I'm Unlimited Pilates bar. Again, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.